Hi everyone, Ian here, West Coast of Ireland. Um, we're doing a blade test today, our homemade blades. We're going to test them and um, we're in, actually in the back of my van so you can hear me from the wind. But uh, before we can move on, uh, we've done a static balance test in our workshop and we've done our dynamic balance in our workshop. I'll show you that when I put the blades on. Um, but we won't really know our dynamic balance until we hit some our high RPMs. Um, we also need to determine if the blades have uh, a, a good low wind speed, start-up speed. So today's pretty low wind day, and um, also we need to know whether they will reach high RPMs in um, in reasonable winds as well. Um, we want to check for acoustic sound and we also want to determine the, the amount of vibration and to iron out any other problems that may we may have overlooked. So this is it. Um, do the blades get fiberglassed uh, or do they get recycled as heat on my wood stove? <laughs> um, let's hope hopefully not. Um, Okay, so let's get on and put the blades on. So that's the that's the cover, and uh, <coughs> here are the blades. The blades in our hub, and uh, that is dynamic balance that way. And this is static balance that way. So hopefully, when we put the blades on, we'll be, t be able to tell whether they're balanced correctly. Right. Just grab the camera now, and uh, say it's not too bad today. There's our um, direct direct drive turbine, three blades on it at the moment, and uh, you can see our cups on the roof. Uh, I suppose seven miles, possibly up to about twelve miles an hour. So let's see see the blade start. There she goes, they're starting already. And uh pan back a bit. Uh, they've stopped. Come on, give us a gust. I think one of my bearings is a little bit tight as well. To uh, cheat a bit, <laughs> but they're going round now, and uh, we just need a bit of a gust now. As I can say, it's got a furling tail and there's going to be four different braking systems on it but for this test we really need to know does the um, are the blades balanced and what sort of vibration problems we're going to have there she goes now starting to pick up she's 
putting out some power now. Very little vibration. Um, most of it's just this dodgy pole it's on, I think. Let's have a look at that. And remember, that's a four to one ratio. <clears throat> so the PMA uh, will be going around four times faster than these blades. So as we're cranking out some power, let's fan back a bit and see what she does on her own. Good. Like I say, it's not very windy today, so it's a perfect day to test them. A little bit of bounce on the tail. Like I say, I just think that's the wobble from the t from the pole. Crank it up now. Okay, when she hits some high RPMs, we'll see what she'll, whether the blade will furl. Swing around, so this will be doing what the furl will do. And there she goes, slowing down nicely. And she swings back into the wind. And off you go again. wooden blades and they're going to be fine fast if they pass this test. So far they have passed this test. Like I said there's a little bit of bounce on the tail but we can I can see that that's not the blades it's the actual pole. There you go so it's belt driven and there's my direct drive one which uh, powers we get about two and a half thousand watts electricity for our inverter for that. Uh, we've got 600 amp hour battery battery bank at the moment and we hope to get more. So anyway from from the west coast of Ireland um, Ian's blade test uh, I think it's a success so, thanks for watching guys. See ya. I'll just leave it on for a bit. <laughs> okay, I'll say goodbye now. Thanks again, bye.